Hello and welcome back, folks. I'm Manic Mink. This is Europa Universalis 4. When we last left off, we just ended uh, what I can only assume would be called World War I. Uh, England, Spain, Venice, uh, and a bunch of miners versus um, Italy, Austria, and that's about it, actually. Uh, and we won! Took a province from Venice, which is perfect, exactly what I wanted to do. Um, we forced Venice to stop annexing Modena, which is also what I wanted to do. Uh, we took actually two provinces off of Spain, which means I don't have to go to war directly speaking with Spain ever again at the moment. Uh, because, um,. I took these two provinces, Messina and Palermo, and formed Sicily with them. Good going, huh? Uh, Venice, are you still like me? Let's just improve relations with you. I want to make sure that you don't dislike me at some point for annexing people, which you do because I annex people, and I have unlawful territory, which you don't like either, but... Let's maintain diplomat there. You, meanwhile, Austria and Naples... So I have to go to war with Naples, Spain, and Ferrara. Uh, Spain, Portugal, and Naples. So you'll pull Portugal in. Ottomans are at war with Great Britain and have occupied... What? How is this a thing? Ottomans are at war with Great Britain and have occupied Kent. The Ottomans have. Like... I don't... <laughs> don't even understand. My god, that's crazy. Okay, um, yeah, no longer loyal to us. Commonwealth, blah, blah, blah. So we are annexing Modena. Uh, we are improving relations with Genoa. Fine, I can just kill you. And then I'll just park my troops over in Verona. Uh, what am I losing money on? I'm losing money on maintenance for stuff. I have one level two advisor. That's okay. I think I can still afford that. Um, I am losing inflation. That's good. Okay, good, good. Uh, troops will regain in due time. We will drop our maintenance down to half. to go to war with these guys at some point pretty soon in the next two years. So I'm thinking once uh, once Verona cores, we will send our armies down here, and then we will go to war with Naples. If it be so, I'd love to, but that's not really what I'm trying to do at the moment. check and see when these expire. December 1st, 1553. So I have about a year and a bit. Hmm. It is worrisome. I don't like France in a military coalition against us. Don't like anybody in a military coalition against us. Who's in the coalition currently? Just France. Okay, that's not bad. That's actually not bad at all. Oh, well, it doesn't like us because we dishonored an alliance. Uh, Ottomans don't like us. Russia is neutral to us. It's all fine, I think. Well, let's... Should I cancel annexation? Yeah, I should cancel annexation here. Emperor, I'd love to, but I still have no legitimacy, so it's going to take a little while. How is this doing? Oh, 
Commonwealth is the only one that I have a royal marriage with that I don't really want. There. Let's break it. Something from Trier. Trier is a, an, an elector, but I don't actually want to gain any more alliances at the moment. This should core soon, in November. That'll be good. Invest in an idea. Um, we're still five years away from that, so yes, it's worthwhile. Um, could use some more military ideas, honestly, because this is I'm 18 years ahead of time. Spy defense, that's fine. Uh, Ottomans are doing their thing. Surprised at how powerful the Ottomans are. Jeez, it's really crazy. Still a little Ottoman tech group, but military tech level 12. Which, we're only on 13, so they're pretty close. <coughs> yeah, go us. Verona, what can I build in Verona? Let's build this. Mm, let as much time build up as possible. Actually, let's... Maintenance goes up. We have no boats anymore. That's unfortunate, but okay. And then I need to go to war with you. Oh! Oh, this will be... You still have a truce with me. Perfect. That is very good news. Reason why it's good news, they still have a truce with me, which means they're much less likely to go to war with me. I'm going to take a bruzy. Actually, march you up here. Declare war. Take a bruzy. Call willing allies. You go here. You go... Who else comes into this war? Come on, Ferrara. Yes. Noink. You. And Spain did not join. God, I am... I am the best ever. I think. I am the greatest. Just pump all the rest of them into that. That's fine. So this I'll vassalize, which will unfortunately take up another spot in my, uh, what do you call it, thing. Uh, I can actually stop relation improvement here. Uh, and I'd like to improve relations with France as much as I can. Once I got Austria on my side, I think I'm pretty good. Oh, unfortunately, Austria is just marching in and killing everybody here. Which, you know, it's partly good, partly bad. I mean, partly good because it's nice that they're killing people and sieging through territory for me. Partly bad because, honestly, I'd sort of prefer to have the territory myself. But I guess you gotta do what you gotta do. This is the most important bit here. I move, they move. Perfect. Now I'm sieging through all the terror. Oh man, this is... I'm doing really well on this. Like, this is... We could be ending the series, like, by next week at this time, at this rate. What? No! I have... Lose claims on all these. Ah, uh, no. Well, okay, some of them are okay. Uh, 
lost it on Cunio, probably. We lost it on this. Probably lost. Well, yeah, that's. Oh, that's we can't say that. We can't say Modena. We can't say Corsica or Genoa, but that's okay, because we'll get cores on them once we. And I didn't want to go to war with France or. Uh, call it Austria anyway, honestly. Siege of Ferrara. Super Peace. Italian Bass. Done. Uh, raise taxes, because taxes are worth more to me. And I sent it into a military coalition, that's fine. This will siege through just so just problem though. So then you we will take a bruzy and we will probably force you to release or to to annul treaties with uh, the other guy over there, Spain. Uh, then just alternate between war with Venice and war with, um, Naples. Relation with the Ottomans may as well, right? Ottomans doing very well this game. Not quite as good as when I played them, obviously, but, um... You know, it's still doing very well. Losing a bit of money, unfortunately. Probably just due to attrition. You can more than likely lower this a bit. Austria is at war with the Commonwealth. Sure, we'll join in. I like keeping Austria on my side, even though the Commonwealth is fucking huge. My god. Just looking at things, keeping an eye on stuff, making sure that we're doing okay. Pretty soon, these two sieges. We want to take a bruzy and annul treaties. There. Yeah, we want to take a bruzy and then annul all treaties with Spain. It's preferably what, what I'd like to do. Still can't become an emperor. Pretty proper fleet I'd like to do, but we need to actually money then. Okay, so here. Uh annul treaties with wait, well, this did you automat oh you automatically annul the treaty with them. Good. that, 94. Uh, that would mean Austria. Well, actually, the only people who wouldn't like me that much would be Naples, Venice, Spain, but they already hate me. France already hates me. Hungary already hates me. Austria would only dislike me a little bit more. But then I have to make all those into cores, and that is quite difficult. Okay, so I have to take those three if I want to do this next war, and I do. Eh, frustrating. 44% overextension. What if we went... Where are their most expensive provinces? Uh, Abruzzi. Bari.
40% overextension. Hold on, let me see uh, who has cores down here. Naples, Italy, Venice. Uh, I was trying to think if I could sell this to uh, Sicily. That would be a good idea. Now, I need one more province. Naples are the only one with cores here. Okay. It's 40% overextension, that's 44% overextension. 33.7. That would leave them at 86% to take their three provinces and force them into personal union. Send our demands, we'll do this. Thankfully, these are not imperial provinces, so Austria will still like me. Worrisome, but okay. I guess I'll start coring them. cost that much. If it was a few hundred, I wouldn't, but... some Okay. So once the war stops... Right. Okay, yes, because, um... Reasons, I remember. for production efficiency, try to increase our money as much as we can, better diplomatic reputation, that's good. Once this war finishes, uh, I will start annexing Modena again. Uh, Corsica we can't do until a while from now, probably. feel okay. We're still doing good. We have terrible legitimacy. Absolutely terrible legitimacy, but I think I'm going to have to die a couple times for that to get a bit better. Still, 556 is just a great, amazing leader. I have no idea how cool that is. Just blowing our money at the moment. Pretty soon, by the end of the year, I would think. Ah, two years. Okay, never mind. Never mind, two years. Relations with Ferrara. Trade dispute against Spain. Claim that, what? Why can we no longer claim that these are ours? Doesn't it reset every time you go to war? Okay, so Spain, Sicily, and Venice. Well, shitbags. I guess it's okay. We will uh, we'll end up going to war with them again anyway. Uh, war! France declared war on us with coalition CB. That's great. Did Austria join? Austria joined. French, Italian, punitive war, that's wonderful. France and Venice. Let them send their troops around and split them up as much as they will. Ah, 
ran on a big cliffhanger here. Come on, I could use some help here, guys. I'm not going to get any help from Austria, am I? I will not. Problematic. I negotiate a separate peace with someone who is a target with a war goal. Well, I want to... Let's run away as best as we can. Well, we'll have to see how this goes next time. Uh, unfortunately, I think we might be in trouble unless Austria can come here and back me up, because that's 80,000 troops. Uh, right, so... Manic Mink, playing Italy. This is Europa Universalis 4. Hopefully we'll see you later. <laughs> Take care.